Hey, uh, okay. Ostafops. Doff. Fop. Foss. Ostafop. Sado. Fop. Foss? Is that a code? Lord of the world! She's back! Anne Harlow is coming back and trying to repopulate her island. What up, peeps? Slipgator here. Welcome back to some more Anno 1800, the game that just keeps on giving. You guys, big fight stuff and things are about to happen. The dolphins have come out. What are those? Sailfish? Dolphins? Swordfish? Sailfish? Have come out to see it as well. A big fight's about to go on, and we've got to make sure we don't allow Anne Harlow to repopulate her pirate island. If we do, there'll be hell to pay. That's right, let's check this out, man. Hot battle action about to happen. Attack! Oh! Turn around! Oh my God, you guys are terrible. Oh, you're so stupid! You are so stupid! Oh wait, that's a pause. Uh, resume game, right there. There we go, there we go, there we go. Come on, man. Don't let her get in there. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, you're done. It's all over for you. I'm never going to let you back into your island, Anne Harlow. All right. Yeah, whatever that means. So, uh, stuff and things are happening. Anne Harlow's coming back. Everybody's happy about it. That's good. What are you doing? Oh, this is the HMS Solo assigned to an expedition. And down here on Canned Food Island, check it out, ladies and gentlemen. Canned food supplies are looking good. So I changed the trade route and I've upped our canned foods from 25 to 50 and we're moving those up to our main island area place. I think this guy is gonna go ahead and, oh, oh, that's bricks. Okay, he's not doing what I thought he was doing. So yeah, we're making a good amount now, a decent amount here. Now it says that the production is stable. I really, really hope that Anno comes out with an update soon. That gives these that that makes these numbers more accurate and actually tell you some some useful information because the way that they are now it's just the guessing game. The reason that it says stable is because we're shipping some out, but the production on the island is actually doing great. Look at this bad ombre right here; it looks so good, super unbelievable and amazing canned food production brought to you by Slipgator with trees. Do you see the trees as well? I mean, are you not entertained? So, um, yeah, it looks really good over here. We're making a ton of stuff. Now, just to check on a couple of supplies here, let's take a look at stable beef and stable red peppers. Uh, and then we have increasing goulash, which is exactly where we should be. The canned food is actually increasing. So we're doing pretty good. If we pop up over here to the main island deal, let's go ahead and take a look. Where's our canned stuff and things? We got a lot. 200. So eventually, I think we'll fill this up completely. And we won't really need to worry about it anymore, which is great. So another need of the people My has been met. Leave to express itself. Universities, sewing machines, canned food, everything is good except for fur coats. What? That's right, fur coats. Popping over here. We're going to need cotton. We're going to need to make that cotton into cotton mill. Uh, and, or cotton plantation makes cotton. Cotton fabric, pardon me. And then we're going to also need to get some hot fur action going. Now, that all needs to be done. Uh, in the new world. So let's pop down over here and take a look. How's our little deal doing? Calencia? Uh, new -ton town. Berg. Does that work? Bergto? That's perfect. Um, all right. So over here, we do have cotton fertility. It is the thing. Let us take a look real quick and see. This just requires, what are they even called over here? Jornalero? Yornaleros, and then these guys need Yornaleros as well, which we have plenty of. Uh, this is a one minute to a 30 second, so we'll need two cotton plantations for every one cotton mill. Uh, and then this is a one minute as well, but we're going to need fur production. Is there any islands down here that have that, or is that only an old world thing? I'm feeling like it may just be an old world thing. Pop over here. Yeah, it doesn't look like we can do it down here. So, old world pop back over. No fur production over here. Yes, fur production up here on Close Schnapps Island. Yes, over here on Beer Island as well, we have fur production. Um, and let me take a look real quick and see how much room is that going to take? How does this even work? Ooh, it looks like... Yeah, it's going to take a decent amount of room. It looks like that these are kind of like hunter's huts, or pardon me, the lumber deals. So, 
they're going to need a lot of room, which kind of sucks. I don't like lots of room. I need lots of room even, I should say. Hmm. It looks like we could actually fit those guys up over here. This might not be a bad spot right there for it. It's one minute per. Let's go ahead and do... Uh, one, two. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that's a three right there. Maybe right here. Back one more. Three. Did that change the speed in which it's going to produce? Let me put a city down. Not a marketplace, but a small warehouse. We'll squirt it down right over here. We'll need some sexy roads. Pop these guys down over here. Hopefully, everybody can reach that. We'll take a look and see here. I can never remember if it's an extra 15 seconds to process or an extra 15 seconds to build. I think it was just an extra How little bit of time to build. To get back to the blue. So there's three right there. Let's pop back into our consumables yet again. Uh, can we do 93? There's four. And then five. But this is going to be a little bit wacky. I think already we'll have to reposition uh, that warehouse there. Let us build a road up back over to here. Let's build this guy down over to here like that. We got a nice space right in the center there. Yeah, that looks like a good spot. Let's go ahead and move this guy right over to here. And then we'll get a road. Oh, that means one of the guys isn't going to be able to reach. Hmm. This guy's no bueno. Uh, let me delete him. We'll just do four guys for right now. I'm not sure how many fur coats that we're going to require. So the planting progress is going to take a little bit of time. But this is four fur per minute being produced. Nailed at Ace Stop. The first steps on our journey towards fur coats. New world. Let's pop down over here. Let's go down into this area right here. And then let's take a look at, uh, right there it is, cotton plantations. So we're going to need four of these guys, two cotton mills. Definitely want to put them out in an area where we're going to have lots of room to, to breathe, lots of room to move. Let's go ahead and grab a road and squirt that guy down over here like this. All right. Just taking a look at our wood. It looks like that we're doing okay there. Consumables pop over here again. Let's put a plantation down. Well, let's just put it here. And then let's, <clears throat> pardon me. Let's go ahead and take a look and see. 144 deals. Jeez, that's a lot. It's a lot of deals. Oh, so right there. There we go. 144. Oh, wait, 112. What are you doing to me, Slipgator? 134. There, like that. Let's grab another one. Place them right back over here like this. Take our city deal. Let's go ahead and make a road. Connect it over to there. Dude, this is going to be great. We're back with some stuff and things. Is Who are you? What are you all about? Um, just clicked over 2 million coins, ladies and gentlemen. And we changed some stuff and things. I made some stuff happen over here on Beer Island. That's right. Doubled the beer production. Really wanted to try to maximize the space again. We have a little bit of a deal over here. We could maybe throw a park in there. Um, really wanted to do as much as we could with the space that we have. We're kind of blocking off these coal deposits, but I'm not using them on this island. What do we got over here? That, ooh, we might actually need that limestone at some point. We'll have to see. And we have a little bit of copper over here, too. But, yeah, doubled the beer production. Everything should be good inside of here now if we look. Uh, there's our hops. Our malt says it's decreasing. Not exactly sure why. But the beer, again, it says stable when really I've just doubled it. It should be pretty GTG. Um, we should be getting a lot more beer going because the main place that we're exporting that I do believe is over here at our main spot. And we're not really making a ton. We're kind of floating right around even. So I think doubling it up would be a really good idea. So we went ahead and we did that. Canned food deals. Let's go ahead and check it out, guys. Everything looks eh, more stable. We started to move a little bit more. And even though we've doubled the canned food, it still looks like it's pretty stable. But if we come up here, I think you'll see we have a lot of it now. Yeah, 214. So we're going to get to a point eventually here where we'll max this out. Um, and then we'll have more canned food to move to some other places. So canned food and beer are doing really, really good. Now, as far as fur production goes, that was the next thing that we were working on. Ooh, it's happening. Ladies and gentlemen, there it is. Look, the fur coat factory. Oh, my God. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Ooh, very close. Hey, how's it going, man? Did you see the new fur coat factory? Wait, what? You don't care? You don't you're, You don't have enough money to buy a fur coat? <laughs> Dude, look at this thing, man. It looks great. That guy's got a fur coat on. What's up, fancy? Your name's Tim? All right, that's Tim. So this is pretty cool. Looks like there's some looms here or something like that going on. What's the back look like? Yeah, there's the little bundled up fur coats, maybe. I don't even know what those are. 
This is looking pretty cool. There's Tim. He went inside. He's going to purchase his very first fur coat. So, fur coat stuff and things are here. Now, I did this a little bit differently, but I do want to go ahead and check out what kind of... Okay, 84 fur. We only have eight cotton fabric left. So, remember, this requires, I do believe, just one and one. But we are giving it fur much more quickly than we're giving cotton. Um, and the reason that is, mostly, I think, is because of the travel time. Um, the travel time between the old world and the new world is taking a lot of time up. Uh... Well, we didn't necessarily need to upgrade that, but it'll be fine. So, and we are seeing a massive jump in our balance from this. Providing these fur coats to everybody. Whoa, I'm sorry. Oops. There we go. Providing these fur coats to everybody is really increasing their taxation rates and all that stuff. So it's going pretty good. But it looks like down over here, let's just look again. Fur, we're going to need more cotton stuff. Let's check out what's going on this expedition. A fistful of doubloons. The ship's coffers have been empty. What? Track the thieves down. The fleeing footprints are easily found. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Hunting or crafting? Let's hunt them. Kill them all. Your crew find no guarantee of safe crossing. Eh, whatever. I can't make any promises. <laughs> all right. So that's going pretty good. All right. That expedition. So the other thing I wanted to check out is we pop up over here now and then we take a look inside of here. At our furs. It looks like we are moving all of them over. And the way that I chose to do this this time was with trade routes. Now, trade routes cost us 50 coins, okay? And they can move up to 80 goods. Now, if we take a look down over here at our main island and we pop over to um, this guy, our shipyard, we can get a little bit better idea of some stuff. So, upkeep cost on a clipper is 175. The trade route only cost me 50. Now, I can move 200 with a clipper. So, the pricing there, whatever. Uh, the upkeep cost on a schooner is only 15. Um, I can move 50 with that. But then we got to have, like, multiple schooners or something like that. So, I don't know. I thought we would try out the trade routes. They do cost a little bit of money. But with a clipper, Waiting new horizons. I guess we could do 200 with that clipper. How's the math work on that? 50 for 80. 160 would be 100. Yeah, the clipper probably costs a little bit. It's, no, it sounds about even to me, to be honest with you. Uh, once we get up into some higher levels, we're start going to start to get steam power. Then we might go ahead and change some of those trade routes. Dockyard dupe. Robbed! 50% chance with naval power. 20% chance with crafting. 10 with diplomacy. Naval power! That's right. Swift justice! And we gained some morale. Feels Just good, team. Eat your fish and go about your day. All right, so down over here, let's go to the new world. And let's go ahead and just check out and see how are those charter routes holding up with the production that we have down here right now. Eh, not so good. So let's go ahead and set up a route. A charter route? I don't think I can do, like, any more than just 80 on this. So what I would want to do is go ahead and create a route. We'll create another charter route. We'll go ahead and call that that guy. We're going to select this harbor. Then we're going to go to the new world. Old world, I said. We're going to select Sliptonville Berg. And we're going to set that guy for 80 as well. We'll charter that. So hopefully that will provide us with a lot more cotton up there. If we have two routes, it does take a really long time to see the impact, though. It takes a really, really long time to see stuff uh, make its way up betwixt the worlds. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. Dude, we haven't been really bothered by this guy yet. What is his name? La Fortune? I've tried everything with you. Gene? <laughs> Gene Laffertoon. Uh, he hasn't really been bugging us, so I'm not really going to worry about him too much right now. There are a lot of islands here, man. One, two, three, four, five, six that we could take over. Um, and then on the old world, we still have, I think, one, two. Oh, did she take this over over here? No, she just grabbed it. Barrel Omera just grabbed this island right here. And that is no bueno because this has limestone deposit. It has copper, well, coal, iron. It's a big, big island too. So uh, probably going to be a good idea if we hmm, find a clipper somewhere. Do we have a clipper that's idle? Good and ready. You're idle because I was bringing bricks down here. Let's go ahead and drop these guys over here like so. And then I think we're just going to continue to monitor Can the fur coat situation. It? I'm going to go ahead and get some more islands populated here. Hey, uh, okay. Ostafops. Doth. Fop. Foss. Ostafop. Sado. Fop. Foss? Is that a code? 
Is that like up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, select, start? Dude, I have no idea uh, what's going on over here, but I cannot mobilize any additional people fire people, I don't think. Your <laughs> that is super, super weird. Is there anything else? Okay, the police station looks okay. Uh, let's go over to our main island here. Let's look at maybe like our hospital. Uh, okay, it looks okay. There's definitely some weird stuff and things going on out there. Uh, we did get a couple of things here. I want to take a look. I think we can increase or add a couple deals over here. No items available in the zoo. Wait, or do they are they not back yet? There's one, dude. We can add museum attractiveness plus 10. Let's go ahead and select that guy. Nice, nice. Museum is looking quite nice, in fact. 120 beauties from this. 60 from that guy. You know what? Real quick. Do we have any ships? You can rely on us. That we sent on expeditions that have stuff. All ships on patrol escorting. I want idle ships. Oh, what was that? Okay, that guy's. I don't even know. Oh, he's just up here. I think we got this from when we were on. Uh, when we when we took her out. I think we found some beer, uh, beer and fish and stuff like that. That guy's moving to settle a new island. That guy's moving to settle a new island. Jolly Roger Pirates, naval power. You swivel on a sixpence, ready to blow them away. Fire the cannons. The pirates are sunk. Dude, nice. Congrave rocket. Damage per shot plus 10%, except. Very, very cool. So we have a couple of things, I think, that are going to be coming back. I'm pretty sure we got some new animals for the zoo. We just have to wait for those expeditions to make their way. Um, all right, so over here now, we're ready to rock and roll. Does that look like a good spot? Settle this bad ombre. An empire from nothing nice. Set some uh, more wood. Oh, we can't actually put it in there right yet. And then I sent another guy up to this little itty-bitty island. Conqueror! Ready for a challenge. We're GTG here as well. Uh, this guy's got some clay, copper, a little bit of zinc, iron, some limestone, so iron, and clay. ruins behind. And um, the other guy, let's go ahead and take a look here after we upgrade we these. Gained an influence bonus. This guy down here, uh, looks like we can see it right here. Clay, iron, coal, little limestone, fur, red peppers, hops, and potatoes. Way. They're both kind of little itty-bitty islands, but I thought it would be kind of cool commission? to get them settled. We got this guy here I think we can get. And then what about down over here? Looks like a couple other little small islands. Maybe would be good for brick. I think there's one guy right here. And then... This guy right over here, too. Might just be cool to have this for these deposits in the future. So I think we got to send our clippers back. No, you can't. I'm taking all the islands, lady. There's nothing you can do about it. I'm expanding the empire. Looks like we got problems down south, kids. You think you got what it takes, homie? Left Fortune, you're going down. Oh, dude, he destroyed one of my ships to the line. Bring it on. Dude, it's over for you. He brought everybody against us. Oh, and wait, we're on a quest for Meryl as well. Hold on. Rescue castaways? Dude, I've never seen the castaways. Look at them. They're just over there floating. They're floating above the water. There's magic. They don't need any help. Rescue the castaways, homie. And are you going to rescue the castaways? Attention for the Admiral. Okay, we did it. Barrels, little urchins. Quest item. What? Was that part of the quest? Oh, wait. I think this is some stuff things, some stuff and things over here, too. Go grab that, homie. Is this what we need for barrel? I think that's what it is. Oh, okay. So we got a little bit of gold. This is the quest item here. You guys think you got what it takes? Bring it on! Under attack. Dude, do you think we can take out four? Oh, I don't think we can. Oh, it's going to be over for you, homie. Dude, stop. Uh, Go. The entire fleet. Well, two guys. Fleet ready. Where is it? Crap. Dude, where where were we? Oh, we lost it. Stop. Give me the alert. What are your ships under attack? Okay. Moving to we got to send our guys out here to grab all this stuff. We got two ships going. Hopefully, we can get there in time to get something done. The expedition returns. Sweet. Nice. Harbor Master's office. Maintenance cost minus 25%. Attractiveness plus 15. Very cool. And coffee. We found some coffee. Okay. 
Competitors are now at war. All right, where are we now? Oh, nice, nice. Very, very cool. So... I wish to find a new kingdom here. Wait, this is a different deal. So we can drop this trap here. You're not allowed to do My anything. Of you is <laughs> Your people are starting to get sick. Productivity. Dude, everything just started to happen. We're having such a great little Ceasefire day just kind of hanging out. Ended. Movement speed, increase. We'll leave those guys on Kevin for now. Uh, I don't think we actually got the other thing yet. The ship hasn't officially returned. People are sick. Let's go ahead and mobilize. All right, we're good to go over there. One of our ships was destroyed in this area, and we have two ships of the line headed over this way. Hopefully, to pick up barrel stuff. I think the castaways will... No, 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 no. The castaways should be okay. That's the actual quest item. Hopefully, they don't drown, so we don't have to abandon that mission. Um, down over here, by the way, cotton production is going okay. Um, it looks like we're producing just about as much as we're shipping out. Uh, so over in this area, I'm thinking about, well, wait, there is no such thing in the new world, is there? At least not yet for us. Oh, wait, town hall? Hmm, what can we put in our town hall? I did build one of those guys down over here. No available items. That's not going to do it for us. So I'd love to use some of our items to increase production over here, but we don't have the buildings available in this area in order to make that happen. Uh, boxing ring? What? Dude, we need a boxing deal. Dude, where's the boxing deal going to go? The town hall? Your people are healthy again. Was that reach everybody? No. The town hall isn't really even important. I'm going to leave it up just for funsies, but we're going to pop this guy down over here. Boxing ring is definitely going right in the center there. Dude, let's check this out. What does it look like? Oh, dude, Mexican boxing stuff. Let's go. Can we get inside? Please let us in. Is there a way in so we can see the boxing? Oh, there they go, man. Look at him. Take his butt, man. Do it to him. Oh, wait. Suplex. The dog is into it. Look at him go. <laughs> Dude, you guys, that's awesome. Oh, did they just high five a little bit? What move is that? Never seen it before. Uh, you feel it reflects the time? I feel like it doesn't. I feel like we need riot protection, increased productivity, and happiness. Of course. Propaganda. It's the best. I don't think it's misleading. Um, so back in the new world here, I've just been using uh, the old world, pardon me, using our clippers to go ahead and start colonating the fat guy, and then over here, this guy's done. So now we have. Is it Roschenhoff? Starsborg? Hoping to butter my tea cakes, is it? Ost oven? <laughs> uh, Remba -de 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 the All these guys, they're ours. Feels good. Um, but we got to start to uh, increase our populations with all of them as well. Um, I really want to check out and see. We have some items coming back somewhere. New orders. Now, he's just got some sales. I'm actually going to drop those. We don't really need them. So we'll just let those go ahead and get dropped. This guy, we'll pop him over here, Let too. To be honest with you, since our one guy down there, the pirate is causing problems, I feel like you it might be time influence bonus. to make some more ships of the line. Uh, looks like we have a quest over here. Let's grab that guy real quick. This must appear the people celebrate Artisan your family? Wait, the artisan family. Hold on. Let's read what this says. I find that pretty hard to swallow, you know. An artisan would like to be photographed alongside his extensive family of special occasion. Oh, on the special occasion of their visit to the zoological gardens. Okay. Let's go ahead and take a picture of the artisan family. I'm assuming it's like maybe there. Submit yo photo. He's done it. Family tickets on sale at the Rapture. zoo. Oh, what did we get here? Museum piece. Attractiveness plus 40? That's epic. I have everything to learn from your remarkable collections. Regal gold ring. It is epic. It's an epic item. That's awesome. And I'm sure all those... It's enough out of you guys. Uh, let's check on our Good attractiveness thing now. We're about to take tea. It's only 273, it looks like. But we have 280 culture right now. Which is like... Wouldn't it be the cum? Oh, I guess it probably adds these. Does it add these numbers and then subtract these ones? That would probably make sense. 177 to get to the next level. We have a lot of work to do if we want to be beautiful, guys. It's time, ladies and gentlemen. No more pirates for old Slipgator. It's time to annihilate Jean Le Fortune. I got all these guys over here like so. We should be able to start to slowly take out his defensive attack. forces here. 
I think this one's going to be a little bit weird. I think we're going to try to do this one at a time. If we're able. You got to learn to manage your debt. Oh, you think you got what it takes inside of there, man? I think it might be hard for our ship to actually get in. Looks like we're doing okay. She loves it. Take it to the limit. Oh my God, what an amazing view this is. That's epic. Get wrecked, John LaFortune. Does it give you the forward view of any ship if you select the ship and then hit F1? Hmm, no, now it's not doing it. Well, wait, hold on. Let's try again. I, it does! I got you, I got you. Cool, man! From the perspective of each ship. All right, let's move in. You in this recently polished We've begun our assault. It makes everybody happy. Let's edit the paper, put in some non-riot stuff and things. Censorship is not all it's fine. Don't worry about it. You love it. So it looks like it's actually going to be really hard for us to get in there. Let's speed up this a little bit. I've told all the ships to move in that direction. I could actually take this guy and have him come back out of here. Maybe just head back to base there, homie. You're real hurt. Ship construct. Oh, it's going down. The greedy Gannet. Ah, oh, it's over for the greedy Gannet. Don't worry. We'll hide out as long as we need to. Pirates be gone? Oh, yeah. Pirates defeated. Goodbye, Jean Lefortune. It is over for you. Ship constructed. And more ships are coming. So what we're going to do now is select a bunch of these guys except for three. We'll a send them all back over destroyed. here. Yeah, we know. We were there, homie. Thanks for that, though. Uh, we'll send everybody back except for three ships. Dude, look at this guy. We're not sunk oh, yet. my God. The sails are destroyed. It's not looking too good. I think we should be able to make it back to base, but it's going to be a minute. Look at the death and destruction behind us. I'm pretty much into it. All right. So let's just double check over here again. We're going to leave three ships behind. Yeah, we're going to leave three ships behind, but I think it's going to be three different ships. We're going to leave three ships that are undamaged behind. Take these guys. Can we get them? Yeah, you can barely see. We'll send these guys back over to get repairs as well. You all right there, homie? Dude, Temperance? We're going to rename you. Lucky. Lucky Karen. Lucky Karen! Lucky Karen! It's going to make it all the way back with just a sliver of health. And then the rest of these guys, like I said, will have them move out very slowly. Hey, you learn by now. And we'll leave these three guys. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, slow down, slow down. Dude, she's back. You reached a new milestone. Oh, I've already got you. I'm already ready for you, homie. Wait over here. We already have the ship. Stations. Three guys. We've got to do this manually. Little bonus content. I thought the episode was going to be over, but it looks like, no, that is not the case. Oh, these guys are so far away. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, sorry. Mm -mm -mm. Back, 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 back. Slow down, slow down. The slow down. Has been vanquished. Dude, these are our ships, like, right here? Dude, they're right over by our area. Aye. You couldn't have made a worse mistake. Annie Harlow, what were you thinking? Take <laughs> the ghosts aren't gonna do anything, you silly lady. My family is on it. Can I do it with this one too? Oh, cool! It's over, dude. What are you talking about? Dude, I don't think you're gonna strip out my anything. I'm just gonna be honest with you, Ann. Uh, let's pop this guy back over here. These guys came over. They actually went close enough to our ships to just aggro. That's awesome. Uh, you're going to go back anyway. And then this is just a little extra fleet that I've made in case we need stuff and things to go on. Down over here, we can just move these guys back over for defense. 
Everything's going good. All these little islands, by the way, guys. Well, these guys aren't happy because of clothes. Um, I've started to set up little forward operating bases on all these small islands. So some of these guys are doing good. Oh, this guy didn't get done. Some of these guys are doing good. Some of them aren't doing so good. Uh, most of them still need clothing. What are you talking about, man? Oblast. So most of them are starting to get some sort of infrastructure set up. I still got this guy to do right here. But yeah, guys, thanks so much for coming to hang out with me. That's going to be it for today. Make sure if you like the video, please don't forget to show your support. Smash the thumbs up button. If you're new and you haven't already, subscribe for more. And always, as I like to say, uh, thank you to everybody who supports on Patreon. You guys make this channel happen. Thank you very much for all of your support. And may the stuff and things be with you.